Also tonight, an arson investigation is underway in Garfield County. Investigators telling us it turned out to be a costly fire. News 4's Natalie Clydesdale joins us from there with the details. Well, this is all that is left after more than 100 bales of hay went up in flames here just a few days ago. Investigators say they think the fire was intentionally set, but right now they don't have any leads on who did it. Firefighters rushed to put out these massive flames roaring through dozens of hay bales alongside a Garfield County Road early Friday morning. We didn't realize the magnitude of this until we got there. The inferno burned through 105 hay bales total, leading to a heartbreaking wake-up call for Gerald Brackage. About 2.30. Well, they want to know if I, want, I could bring a tractor up here. My hay was on fire. Brackage was able to salvage some of the highly coveted alfalfa, but the loss was financially devastating. Those bales run around $250 to $260 a piece. So this was roughly $26 to $27,000 in hay bales lost. It's this kind of like cutting part of your arm off. Not to mention, the state's drought is making hay hard to come by. It's nearly an irreplaceable commodity. We, we did a program in February talking about what to do in the case of extended drought. We didn't think we'd still be doing extended drought programming in October. Investigators aren't sure who started this blaze, but they're confident it was set on purpose. And this has been ruled arson. Like, you know, pay attention. If you see suspicious activity, call the sheriff's office or call 911. In Garfield County, Natalie Clydesdale, Oklahoma's News 4.